we are in our sinfulness, cut off from God, condemned by God, enemies of God, slaves to sin, dominated by Satan, children of wrath, lovers of darkness, minds blinded, emotions disordered, bodies defiled. You got skeletons in your closet? Shameful secrets in your past? Scandals? Humiliating things, embarrassing things, horrifying things. Stop running. Stop hiding. Stop pretending. Welcome to the people of God. Think of it, that the God of the universe would look at your life and my life and say, I have absolutely no record of anything ever having gone wrong. God specializes in working in the compost of human sin to achieve His perfect and holy will. Because we're closed in Christ, He says, I have record of everything having gone right in your life. That is a scandal. Why do bad things happen to good people? It's the wrong question to ask. So why do good things happen to bad people? Because there is a God who is so utterly sovereign, He can use evil to achieve salvation through the only one who has ever been altogether good, Jesus Christ. Because this gospel is powerful enough to save. There is not a people group on the planet that is beyond the power of God to save. And a people who believe that cannot sit on this gospel. A people who believe that will lead churches and give lives to make this gospel known. To what extent is God truly sovereign? He is this sovereign. He uses the most flagrant expressions of human disobedience and deception to achieve our salvation. That's how sovereign He is. I wonder what all of this may mean for you.